Hello everybody, um, back after a really busy season here. Sorry I haven't really done many videos um, this summer, just work's been right on top of me, as you probably all um, know that feeling. Um, just showing you the square at the moment, and um, this is about nine days in, so it's not too bad. Some of the ends are uh, gonna come through a bit slower, which is expected. Just been in uh, this weekend just to do a bit of watering by hand. That way I can kind of pick out the one that what I want to give a bit extra water, what I don't. Um, some of the ends are a bit capped, so I don't really want to be giving them too much. Um, I just want them to dry so they crack. Um, and then it gives a chance for the seed to come through. Just thought I'd do a few sort of things for the next few weeks of a newly renovated square like this. So, um, obviously on my mind is the first cut. A little bit away from that at the moment. Um, I'll be looking to do that. At the moment we're probably at one, one leaf stage. So when we get to the two, three leaf stage and it's around about 30, 40 mil, then it will be topped. Um, if my ends are a bit thin, then I can always go through, uh, go round them. Um, so that'll be the first cut um, with a rotary or with a cylinder. Ideally, I think a rotary is pretty good as long as the blades are sharp. That's probably a good choice to start with. But if not, just make sure um, blades are sharp, soil's dry, you're not picking up loam or anything on the roller or tearing out. Um, Make sure that um, when you go to pull the, the new grass leaf, um, it sort of rips in half rather than pulls out by the roots, not a bad one. So first feed, well speaking for this one, probably gonna have to probably cut it two or three times over two or three weeks. Um, then it will start to grow for slow. It will start to get a bit yellow. And prior to rain, that will be the time when i get on some soil conditioner probably as long as it's going to rain a lot and an autumn winter fertilizer in low nitrogen sort of six eight percent maybe a bit lower them sort of numbers in nitrogen um, and regular cutting trying to thicken that plant up before things slow right down in sort of mid-november get as thick as we can um, you know before before winter really sets in the cold sets in first spike um, at the moment I think if you went to put a pin in the middle of this square most squares you put or a screwdriver you'd struggle to get in more than an inch maybe I'm sure some places a lot less than that so until you can comfortably do that you probably can't be spiking and also at the moment you'd end up plucking out the new the new rooted seed so you're probably looking at mid to late November get a couple in before Christmas, um, end of January latest, probably mid-January really. But if you can't do it in the right conditions, best leave it, I think. But yeah, so we've had the first cut, first feed and first spike. That's kind of me done here. Um, if you have any questions, just put them in the comments. And what I also do in the comments, I'll just drop some relevant um, blogs that I've written um, based on, on what I've spoken about in this, in this uh, video. Thanks for listening.